Hey, what's up you guys? I'm Gio the Sparky and today we are back with our Let's Play Deltarune Part 2. In the first part, we met Chris, we met Susie down here, this little bitch dino down here, and we fell into this mysterious world where we look like some sort of weird blue night thing. Plus, we're gonna continue on, we are going to go into this weird castle, and also I just realized in Part 1 I'm a fucking idiot because it was Asiel Toriel broke off and it was not Asgore, so so Asgore and Toriel are still not together, and that's why Toriel got a negative comparison on DeviantArt from me, but I still love her. But yeah, so Asriel is still alive, so I wonder if he's gonna come back in this, and I'm curious. So we're gonna go, we have this um, lovely um, black thing going in the sky, let's go into the castle and see who's there. Here we go, up the stairs. A castle? Why the hell is there a castle inside a supply closet? Welcome, heroes! <laughs> Who's there? Do not be alarmed. I am not your enemy. Please come forth, both of you. Who is it? Who's this? It's a demon! It's a raven demon! It's a grey one! Welcome. I'm the prince of this kingdom. The Kingdom of Darkness. Darkness. It is very dark in there. Chris, Susie, there is a legend in this line. I love the gold fonts. A legend says one day two heroes of light will arrive and fulfill a, the ancient prophecy foretold by time and space. Please, heroes, listen to my tale. I want to say no, but I have no idea what he's going to say, so I guess you should listen to get the story going. Let's listen. I love that they give you an option. Very well, then. Here we go. What's this epic tale? Once upon a time, a legend was whispers among shadows. It was a legend of hope. It was a legend of dreams. Souls and dreams. It was the legend of lies. It was the legend of dark. This is the legend of Delta Rune. Also, do I my headphones going around at me? For millennia, light and dark have lived in balance, bringing peace to the world. But if this harmony were to shatter, what would happen? A terrible calamity would occur. The sky will run black with terror. And the land will crack with fear. Crack with <laughs> Why is that moving so much? Then her heart is pounding. The earth will draw her final breath. Ooh. And they have the symbol in sucks. Only then, shining with hope, three heroes appear as world dead. A human, a monster, and a prince from the dark. Ooh! So this is how we're going in the closets. Only they can seal the fountains. So we have fountains now. And Spanish the angels heaven. We're bashing angels! Okay. Only then will balance be restored. Yeah, we gotta get rid of the sully angels to back to the sword pants. And the world saves from destruction. What destruction? Today, the fountain of darkness. The geyser that gives this land form. What happens? Stands tall at the center of the kingdom. Where's the fountain of light? But recently, another fountain has appeared on the horizon. Is this where we're going then? And with this, the band of light and dark begins to shift. Ooh. So, there are two fountains of darkness now, so I guess we have to get rid of the other one, do we? Chris, Susie? Thank you for listening to my long tale. I deeply believe you two are the heroes of the legends. That despite whatever enemies you may face, 
you two have the courage to save the world. Delta Warriors, please, won't you accept your destiny? This is getting like, re we're getting all anime on this. This, this. this is getting really like superhero-y. And I love this. Oh, Susie's not happy. Uh, nah. Oh my god, you bitch! Susie! Uh, what? Okay. Some kind of hero or something? You've got the wrong person. But, but Susie, without you, the world will... So lost if the world gets destroyed. It's not my damn business. Might even be kind of fun, honestly. Oh my god. Susie, you're you're dark. You're dark. You're such an emo. And the demon's like, eh. Anyway, Chris. If you want to play pretend with this weirdo, stick around. I'm going to find a way out of here. Susie, wait! <coughs> what was that? Oh! Ho, ho, ho! The heroes are already running away! And they didn't even know I was here! My dad's gonna make me son of the month! Who the hell are you? I'm... Oh, my spin. The bad guy! Well, nice knowing, but what's your name? You clowns want to steal our dark mountain, huh? And still picturing you guys as clowns. Save the world from eternal darkness, huh? Uh. Don't try to deny us. We both know you'll go east. It's our only way home. Thus I, Lancer, that's his name, Lancer, won't let you go there. And I got a flawless tested plant to insurance! Step one! I thrash you! Step two! You lose! <laughs> oh my god, this is like a really joke villain. Is this gonna be like one of those robots on OKKO where they seem really evil and then they're just a total innocent joke trying to impress your dad kind of thing? <laughs> nice plan, kids. Uh, really? <laughs> Look at his face, it's just like... <laughs> it's, it's kind of adorable, actually. Yeah, actually. Might have we used on you and- Oh, oh, that's gonna be- Oh, we're gonna voice! Lancer, bust in! Okay, we're gonna voice. Okay, so we got voice, we got axe, we have license, we have spear, and we have defense. Okay, let's see what we can do to axe. Axe on Lancer. Go! Let's get him a warning, actually. That's one of not Sue. Tell Lantern to watch out for Susie's attack. He readies himself. Oh, oh she attacked but she missed. Oh, clowns! This bike is filled by victory! Oh, now he. Oh, he's gonna. Oh, whoops. Oh, he took damage. Susie took damage. Don't know how I got an axe, but, like, that's cool. Yeah, I guess he should try complimenting it. You tell Lantern you can't tell the difference between his clothes and his body. Price. Okay. He seems fluttered. His attack power went down. Okay. And, and does he miss again? Why is he missing? Ow! You make my feelings do wheelies! Sweet wheelies! Oh, he's attacking. Okay. Okay, we managed to avoid this. Okay. Lantern's most psycho is actually just a fight that's on fire. Uh. Okay, I guess we should compliment him again because his attack went down last time. You tried to compliment Lancer again. But he sees this as insincere. His attack power goes back. Oh, god damn it. And she's missing. Okay. Did you not realize I can mask my self esteem levels? Uh. Hmm. That's not a good sign. Oh, he took damage again. Okay. Lancer rests viciously. I guess he should defend then. Cause... And she keeps missing. Why is she missing him? Ho ho I'm the bad guy! Okay, we managed to defend- Okay, he's attacking with these, um, spades or clubs, whatever they are. I- I always get the mix up. Wait! Wait a second! My bike's running out of fuel! Alright, you punkaroos! You have to look at the draw this time, but... Next time, the losers will be you! Ah ha ha! Hi, losers! I gotta get home before- 
where it did. You're such a baby villain, aren't you? You won. Got zero eggs and thirty-nine dollars, I'd say. And there's a demon bag. Are you two okay? Um, allow me to introduce myself more properly. I am. Please, can you take off that hood? Yeah, that'd be a nice idea. I can barely hear you under there. No, that'd be a nice idea. You know, show your face. That's nice. Nice to be able to. Uh, um. All right. Oh, hello. Oh, you're cute. Oh, I'm gonna have to come up with a voice for this guy, aren't I? Hello, everyone. I'm Rousey. That's such a raven name. You're a raven demon, and you have that is such a raven warrior name. Anyway, you're cute. What are you? I don't know what you are, but I like your little scarf and heart. So. Chris, Susie, it's ever so wonderful to meet you. Yeah, I'm just gonna just experiment with voices and decide if John suits this guy because I have no idea what this is supposed to be. <laughs> I'm Susan! Okay, yeah. I'm just not gonna use my normal voice on this guy because. Or just try. Blah, blah, blah. I'm Susan! We're going to become great friends and. <laughs> Best way to leave is ease, right? <laughs> yes! That's for real! <laughs> Got it. And uh, she's gonna go. <laughs> See, that's cool, Chris. And she just get, gets help. I just realized she had a heart belt as well. Um, I suppose it's just two of us then. Chris, I'm a prince, but I um, currently don't have any subjects. I've been waiting alone here. Um, my whole life for you to, uh, to arrive. Oh, so he knows you were coming. Destiny! So, I'm really happy to meet you. I hope we can be good friends, Chris. Oh, I just realized as well that Chris... Let's try to find Susie. She must be to the southeast. Okay. And I just realized how um similar Chris is to Frisk, and that's a gender neutral as name as well. Chris is um a gender neutral name, which I like. I like how they try to keep the... Protagonist gender neutral. I mean, Chris, it, to be honest, he does look like a boy to me, but if people see him as a girl, then that's fine. Okay, I guess he better save as well. Rousey, the lonely prince, is now your ally. The power of fluffy boys shines within you. Yeah, he is kind of fluffy. Yeah, that's really adorable. So let's go really slowly down here. You're Chris? You, you can hold X to ro oh, Really? Right, you'll move faster by holding X. And I'll be right behind you, so don't worry. Okay. Unless you want to get away, in which case, sorry. That's actually. Oh my god, yes! We can actually go faster in this game! That's. Oh, this is the training dumping I made. Now seems like a great time, time to prepare for the enemy. I know I read that wrong, but I don't really care. Would you like me to teach you how to fight? I guess we should, because there are some new things in this that I'm a bit unfamiliar with, so I guess we should at least um, learn to fight in this. Okay, get ready, Chris! See that heart, Chris? That's your soul! The combination of your being! Within is hold your will, your compassion, and the face of the world! If it gets his, you and your friends will use health power. If anyone's HP reaches zero, we'll lose the battle. So, please take care to avoid the enemy's attack. Ready? Let's try dodging. Oh, I can actually attack. Oh, okay, we're actually gonna. Oh, and. Okay, I thought I. Great job, Kiss! You're a natural! Anyhow, after the enemy attacks, it's our turn, Chris! First, I'll teach you how to fight! So, fighting is unnecessary in this world. There's no harm in a thorough lesson. Let's try fighting! Okay, we have fought the dummy. Oh, wow, Chris! That was an amazing attack! Have you done this before or something? Maybe. Maybe. Maybe I might have gone in a genocide killing spree before. You never know. I guess this is a passive run. I guess this is that we should um, do a passive run. Okay, next let's try defending. Simply shield, and the enemies attack will hurt you less. 
not only that, but you'll also gather TP! Watch the orange big bar on the left! I'll explain it next! Okay... Let's try to bend it! Great job, Chris! Now that you've gathered TP, how about spending that TP on one my spell? Oh, we got spells in this! Because it hit the enemy enough, it got tired! Now, if I use my pacify spell on it, it'll fall asleep, and we'll win peacefully! Okay, so... Okay, so we're also can do spe spells. Okay, we use the pacify on the... Oh, he's tired, okay. Now say cast pacify. Great, Chris! We would have won the battle by now! Now I have just a little more to teach you. Acting! With this, even the most violent of enemies can be defeated through various acts of kindness. Chris, though it's just a dummy, why not give it a hug? Okay, so... I guess he just... Hug. Wait, hug Rousey? You hug Rousey? Aww, oh, that's adorable! Uh, Chris? Um, I don't think, um, this is what you're supposed to be doing. Plus, it's nice. Oh, that'd be adorable, though. That's adorable how we got to. And Uncle Tommy! Aww. Aww, that's great, Chris! Each enemy has different acts that satisfy them. When an enemy is satisfied, it's name turns yellow. When that happens, you can defeat it by staring it. If you stare at all the enemies you meet, we'll never have to fight. Okay, so we stare. Chris spared the dummy. Great job, Chris. That'd be the end in a real battle. I'm really happy I had the chance to teach you, Chris. Okay, we won. And we got two dollars for us. Oh, that was fun. You're a wonderful student, Chris. And, er, uh, in case you ever need to refresh her, I... Here, I was a manual for you and Susie. Press C to open the menu and use it in your items. Okay, we got the menu. Okay, I do like how we actually get to, um... How he actually teaches us to the gameplay and stuff, because that wasn't as clear in the last game. And I do like that. Ooh, golden gates. Oh my, the great door is opened. No wonder Lantern is able to come through. Chris, once we pass through this door, our adventure will really begin. A journey foretold, exactly by the prophecy. But Chris, I believe your choices are important too. They're doing the choices stuff again, and it's... I'm waiting for, like, when is this gonna come and bite us in the ass. Like, I'm pretty anticipating this, um, choices stuff. This world is full of all kinds of people, Chris. In the end, how you treat them makes all the difference. So let's try our best to get by without fighting. If we can manage to do that, I believe this tale may have a happy ending. Otherwise, I fear that... Oh, I'm sorry. Is that too much to ask? <laughs> Just give it a silent creep. Uh, oh, I'm sorry. Chris, in the end, what you choose is up to you. Let's later go choices. As long as you're happy with this, I'm happy too. So, just try our best, and don't worry. Yeah, let's try our best. Try our best, and I think that all that, that's all that matters. And then we go. Going in the golden case. Slam the door. Hey! And we got the golden symbol. Here we go. Our adventure begins. With the door closed behind you, your adventure will truly begin. The power of adventure shines within you. It's adventure time! <laughs> okay. Oh yeah, we can run. Yeah. I keep on forgetting that. That's awesome how we can run. Yeah, let's go. Really, really fast. Whee! Oh. The field of Holton dreams. Enemies ahead. You're gonna die. Signed, Lancer. Okay, so I guess we just go through here and um. Uh oh. Ah. Oh. Now we're in a fight. Okay. Rudin drew near. Okay, so let's act. Okay. Lecter. <laughs> and I guess use a defense. Ah, look at him defending in his little scarf. The Elector is the enemies on the importance of kindness. The enemies became tired. I became... 
What? Okay. Okay. Oh! Oh, he took damage! Oh, he's better than him, so... Rudin is starting to fall asleep. Okay, so I guess we should lecture him again, because um, we don't have the magic. Actually, no, defend. Actually, defend him. Defend, because that's what gives us... Okay, can we use magic? Okay, we can pacify him. Okay, Grace. We all say cast pacify. You won. You got zero experience and thirty-five dollars. Okay, let's keep going. So I guess um enemies are just gonna run into us because um we can't seem to outrun them. If you're reading this, I guess you're dead. <laughs> Toins <Toyn's> Lancer. <laughs> oh Lancer, you're such a kid. I love and hate it so much. Just oh, I'll do you again. Hey, don't read the sign! It's a work in process! <laughs> Science Lancer! Ho ho ho! If it isn't my two favorite people! Psych! You guys are doing in my top five! Lancer! Where's Susie? You mean the purple girl? Ho ho ho! Yup, Bells! You're too late to stop me! What did you do? Ha ha ha! It was so simple! She bit me up, so I ran away! <laughs> oh, of course you did. That's a bit anticlimactic. Yeah, I agree with Drowsy there. That is a bit anticlimactic. So, I guess it goes south to you, Stewie. We go south. Oh no, it, it doesn't seem to mess. Okay. Oh, what's this? What's this tree here? There are two objects hanging from the tree. Take one? Yeah, that's. You got the dark candy. There's a candy hanging from the tree. Take one. Yeah, I guess he just take some dark candy. And, you know, I think I'm gonna ignore the slides because Lancer's just um saying a bit of nonsense at this point. Cause um yeah, nonsense. Hey, if you head that way, my chest will thrash you. Is that a thrash? I prefer to think this as an invitation. Oh, Lancer. Oh, here's another one. And here we go. Oh, there's two of them! Okay. A necklace of... A necklace of rudent. Block your paths. Okay. Okay. Let's, let's try convincing, actually. Why is that one blushing? And I guess you should defend yourself, little kitty. Until it's rudent's quiz rising. It was utterly sways. Yeah, I guess that makes sense. Face my diamond cutter. <laughs> Just give him a lecture of friendship and... And he stopped fighting. It's like that scene in Yu-Gi-Oh! Bridge. It's brainwashing people is fun! Okay, let's um, let's convince this one as well. And I guess he should spear this one so it goes away. Okay, you told Rudin to quit fighting. It was other beats ways. And Rousey speared that one. Okay, so now I have one less to fight. Yeah, I guess that makes sense. And then fighting us with diamonds. We got lots of like um, diamonds and claws and card stuff. Don't... Okay, we spear. Rudin thinks about elaborate stones. Okay, I guess we can spear this one as well. Okay, let's both spear this one. Chris Beard Rudin. Yeah, we won. I just feel- What happens if one chooses to spear but the other chooses to fight? What happened doing this? Yeah, I guess he should run. Oh? Hello. Now it's my game. Mamma mia! I'm top chef! My laser's kicked! Works me too, I'm exhausted! And he's like, Damn it, take a listen up! But mamma mia! A scary noise woke me up! A beast was hunched on the table, using the cake like an animal! Aren't that beast and I'm all the same thing? I spritzed this with water, and it hissed and ran off, but my wonderful cake is! <laughs> Aw, Chris, that sounds like Susie. We must be going the right way. Let's try to keep her out of any more trouble. Okay, can I have some cake? The remains of the cake are still smoldering. Take a piece? Yeah, let's take a piece. The broken cake was Isaac's here, key items. Ah, uh, wait. Oh, here's another one of these things. Yeah, I guess he just fight it and... Oh! And what's this thing underneath? It's like a Queen of Parts kind of thing. Rudin and Happy blocks the way. Okay, that's convincing, because that works last time. And, okay, uh, so, um... Rousey can't act, so... You told Rudin to quit fighting. It was out of its ways. Yeah, I guess that makes sense. This one, uh, this one's horn. Is this like a lemon bread sort of thing? Okay. 
I think he's gonna smile the darling smile. I guess we should eyes on here as well. Okay, let's flutter her. And and then Rousey can You tell Tati it seeds looks like nice. He began to think about this. Oh, she's horny. She's turned on. Rousey spirits rooted. Oh, she's turned on. And she's got a red heart as well. We're are we doing like a card theme? Oh. Ugh. We got like a card theme. Don't do Happy is whispering a lovely spell. Okay, that's just spear anyway. Okay, we'll both spare her. But we got like a card thing going on. We got like the hearts and spades and the diamonds. Yeah, it's weird. And I wonder if- Oh, we got another black candy tree. I guess, um... I guess should we take some black candy? There are two- I guess we should, um... I guess we should take the dark candy while we can. And what's this? Check the clock. In order to solve this puzzle, you have to hurry. Okay. 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 So we had to um, step in time. Ah, right. And then the spikes are. Oh, a chest as well. Okay. Dio's great door. Let's save. And maze of deaths. Behold, the maze of death. Prepare to get lost, clowns. Science Lancer. That sort of reminds me of my like Dexter Fan fiction, the partly childish and with a weird name that just has a meaning for the secrets. Oh my god, Lancer. You're you're such a it's a, it's kind of adorable actually. Let's go and get this chest as well. What's in this chest? You open the treasure chest. Inside was a white ribbon. You put white ribbon in your armors. <laughs> that ribbon is armor, Chris! And increases defense! Why don't you try wearing it in the equipment's menu? I think it'll look great on you. Ah. Uh, okay. So. Okay, so we equip, I guess. Again, I guess we, um. Equip on. Okay, we equip the right. Okay, we got the, um. White ribbon on. I got cuteness as well. Okay, so. Okay, I think that's, um. Sorted now, so let's keep going. Oh, yeah, and. I keep on forgetting! I, as much as I love running, I keep on forgetting that it's a possibility. Okay, so I guess we should- Okay, oh my god, these signs, man. Oh, hello. Ho ho ho! Somehow you survived the maze! Yeah, it was easy. All we did was go down one way. I think, um, that one be before the Menaton fight, that was really hard. That was a harder maze. But don't count your blessings before they hatch! Let's see how you bear against this team! Oh, we're gonna do another price. Oh, we got three happies. Okay, three happies blocks away. Okay, so let's um wire this one. And let's have um Rousey defense. Yeah, that's so cute when he wraps her as um scarf. You told Happy has cool tentacles. He began to think about he complimented his tentacles. Oh, oh yeah, it's horny. It's horny. Yeah, and it only can it can only talk in hearts. Okay. Why aren't you guys dressed? You're totally outnumbered! You made the team purity else of- Oh, it's poor as enemies! Their bullet patterns aren't bad at all! It's like a dinner made out of three glasses of milk! <laughs> and Landris is like, eh. I'm not saying you have to be telling him that though, Rousey. It's gonna. And that's um, our usual set out! Why don't we talk about this after the battle? It smells like a soft kiss. Oh, they're doing this smell of soft as well. Okay, I guess. You order and browse to plaster all the all the enemies. Oh, now they're all. We don't need XP. Just encountering your smile is a reward enough. Oh, what's up with the third one? The third one's got teeth. Okay. Oh yeah, nothing's happening. We just wait this to tag out, do we? At least Buddy beats all of me. Yeah, so I guess he can spare these things. Chris spares happy, Rousey spares happy, and this- Why is this one got tea? It's like lemon bread! Oh my god. And what's this one gonna do? It's a heart attack! <laughs> I just realized that now! At the end of this! Oh my dogs are freaking out that pulling maze! Heart attack! Chris spares happy. Great job, Chris! We earned zero XP and eighty-eight dollars. 
three! Now what do I guess? You must, Lancer. You don't get any. Oh. And I have some of yours? No! Fine! Raider losers! And my dogs are picking up next to me. Can I talk to- No, you can't. Oh my god. Lancer, it's off! Yeah. Oh, it's one of these things again. Okay. Oh, run. Okay. Oh, ah, shit. Damn it. Okay, do we do it? There should be, um... Oh, Susie's here. Susie! Okay. Ugh. Open up, you stupid door. Oh, oh, great. It's you guys. Susie! We're ever so worried about you! Um, how to get past those spikes before? Walk to it. But this door sucks. Aw, don't worry, Susie! Now open up after we solve the puzzle over there! Nice. Tell me when to finish this. Uh, Susie, we need you to finish this! Sometimes, proceeding will take all three of us! Furthermore, Honey Chris can seal the Dark Fountain. Oh, we got we a good case of protagonist in Jameer, everyone. So if you don't accompany us, you won't make it home. So you're saying I have to stick with you guys? Yep. Oh, he's so cheerful about this. Like, and she's just, yeah, she's pissed. She's like, might as well. Off she goes. Let's just get this over with. Yahoo! Susie's back in the team! Cue the fan bear! Yay! Susie! Even though you're a fan, you joined the team and that's amazing! Susie, join the party! Woo! Accomplishment so far! <laughs> Accomplishment so far! We flushed the toilet and we got Susie to join us, even though she's a bitch and I don't like her. And she's so... Look at the face! Susie follows as a dis distance such that no one can tell she's associated. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Okay, so cyber friendship. Okay. Oh, sounded like a door opens. Okay. Oh, we have to like step on them at the same time. Oh, what's this? Oh, Chris, I just read I Susie missed a tutorial. Next battle, we should show her how to act. I think she might really enjoy this. Yeah, I guess we... Oh. Okay, see you out the tide finally. You call uh, Rosie Spikes to include Susie in an act. Okay, so... Okay, so we, I guess we get Susie to uh, compliment, and I guess um, Rousey depends. You ordered Susie to flush at the enemy. What? Why the hell would I do that? And attacked us! And smash it before it moves! Ah, look, Susie! It seems harmless. Yeah, it does look harmless. That's a cute little thing. It's like a little wine face with a bear face thingy. It's like a little pussy. If you act nice, we might as well without hurting it! Okay, okay. Hey, little guy. I really like the accent. <laughs> she just wants to fight. You're such a violent bitch, aren't you? Oh! She- Oh! Where'd he get it? <laughs> um, Chris? Maybe I should talk to her. Yeah, we won. We got zero XP and, um... Fifteen dollars. I guess you just talk to Susie then. Okay. Uh, Susie, I suppose you missed what I said earlier. As heroes, we have the power to make a peaceful future. So, from now on, let's try to avoid fighting, okay? Unlike my Zaza Hyder, who keep fighting all the time. You just took it easy on them. If you weaken an enemy, I can use my pacify spell, which can put exhausted people to sleep. Aww. Yeah, you talking is already doing this. Burn. Well, um, just think about this. If 
Nice hat to warn enemies of Bowser, Chris. Okay, so... Susie, the violent tormentor, is now your ally. The power of mean girls shines within you. Okay, we're saving on the steam shop, and we're gonna leave it at that, everyone. So, in this, we met Rouse, we met Lanter, we got a little team going. I'm really curious to see what happens next. Are we gonna have um, another prize? What choices are gonna influence us later? So, be sure to follow me on Twitter, and I will see you guys next time.